guys, so today it's January 1st, which means that the girl of the year at American Girl has just been released. Her name is Blair, and I did end up getting her as well as much of her collection, so I just thought I'd open her up and show you guys what I got. So here is my big bag of stuff, but before I do that, I just want to show you um, what I got yesterday. So one of my coworkers had a used Mia doll that they didn't need because she already had Mia. So I bought her from her. And then I got her reheaded today, so this is what she looks like. She's super cute. She has the strawberry blonde hair, hazel eyes, and then a unique freckle pattern. And then she has this little French braid in her hair. And she kind of has like a few layers. I just have her in this outfit because she did not come with an outfit, so I will probably be buying one separately. And yeah, I'm really excited about that as well. So I ended up actually getting two dolls today. But let's move on to the exciting stuff. So if you shopped in October, you got the holiday passport. And the passport's coupon for this month of January was that if you bought any item in Blair's collection, you got her second book for free. So I did pick that up, and I'm very excited to read her stories and find out more about her. So the first thing I have here is Blair's accessories. They are $30, but they, you get $5 off when you buy them with the doll. So let's open those up. So this is what it looks like all open enough and I'll just pick everything out one by one. So the first thing we have is this little bouquet of flowers. For four. For tablet. And it looks like some postcards, stickers, and then little screens for her tablet. Of course, her gardening bag. This is very cute. It's like a little canvas tote bag with pink straps. And it says homegrown. It has a little bouquet of flowers on there. Just plain on the back. So that was her accessories. The next thing I picked up was her pig. It was so cute and it reminds me so much of Pua from Moana. And I just had to get it. It's so adorable. It's a stuffed animal. It's super soft and it's pink with like little black spots. This has a sweet little face and cute little hooves and a little spirally tail. And this was $20 and I just couldn't resist it. I think that this pig will be a really great friend for Blair. The next thing I have are her pajamas and they were $24. I have this little top. It's a little ruffle lavender t-shirt and it says let your mind bloom and it has a little floral design on there. Then we have the white shorts with, again, a little floral design with purple, blue, lavender, and yellow. And I love this little ruffle down the front and around the bottom. And then she has these soft purple slippers. She has these soft purple slippers with these gray fur balls. These are adorable. I love them so much. So that was her pajama set. Next up we have her garden accessories and these are also $20. The first thing in here is her straw hat. It's this lovely hat with a black ribbon on it. And then my favorite piece, which is the apron. It has these cute little ruffle straps and then a floral design all over with pink pockets and a pink ribbon to tie it in the back. And then her little gloves are turned the same pattern as her pajama shorts. So that was her gardening accessories. Next up we have her gardening outfit. And this one is my favorite just because of the lolly boots. I love them so much. They have these buckle on the sides. And they're just kind of rubbery. And then we have her overalls. They have these little rose designs embroidered onto them and they're just a blue denim. And then her little striped off the shoulder top. It's stretchy has Velcro on the back and she also has a little green ribbon choker and then last but not least we have Blair herself so she comes in this um, lift off top box and it's a light blue color and it has that floral design that you see I think on her pink dress which I didn't actually get it has a little girl of the year 2019 sticker on it and then at the bottom there's a little picture of her and everything that comes with her. And this is Blair Wilson. So I'll open her up. Her book has 
stuck to the inside of her box, but here it is. This is her first book. Here she is in the box. She comes in a bee printed dress um, and some purple platform sandals. And then her little yellow bandana that she wears on her wrist is on the side of the box, as well as her comb with her flower, her flower comb. So let me get her out. She had a plastic strap holding her neck in, which I've never seen before. Usually it's that like elastic band. So that's a new thing. So I just took her aside to fix that, but it's really nice. It's super curly. It's kind of a bright red, just like Trinity 61. And then if you pull it down, it's pretty long, stretched out. But when it's curled, it's probably about to the middle of her arm. And then, like I said, her extra accessories are tapes inside the box. So I'll just quickly get those out. So here she is all dressed up. So I'll just give you a quick overview of what she looks like. She is a Josefina Mold doll. She has the green eyes. She has the lighter skin, just like Truly Me 78. That's one of the newer skin tones that came out this summer. Um, she does not have freckles, which I'm a little bit disappointed about, but I'll get over it. And she has the kind of super curly hair. Um, it's kind of like Rebecca's. And she comes in a little hairstyle. So this is what it looks like. It's a waterfall braid. If you've ever been to the AG hair salon, it's exactly the same as Camille, the leather shirt's fancy style. Here's a close-up of her face. She does look very sweet. And then here's her dress. It's got bees all over it. It's got this little bow design at the front. And then buttons on the skirt. And then she has some purple platform sandals that look like something Julie would wear. Here's her little yellow bandana and her flower comb. This is what it looks like. And her, here's her hair at the back. And her dress. So that's Blair. I'm probably going to be renaming her because I'm not a huge fan of the name Blair. I thought it would be really cute to have a nickname of B since she does have bees all over her dress. And I think it would fit really well with her theme. But yeah, that's everything I got today. I hope you enjoyed this video and make sure you tune in for my next one.